right, everyone, here it is, the as promised aim track light gun mapping tutorial for Techno Parrot on the Manhattan Project. So first things first, you need to make sure that you have both, either one or both of your light guns if you're wanting to map them plugged in before you start. If you do not, I know it sounds ridiculous, but if you do not, it will not map correctly. All right, that out of the way, we wanna get into the taskbar. To do that, we wanna press the player one start button and player two joystick up. As you can see, pops up here. Now, you're gonna to wanna to go down to the bottom and as my friend, Mr. Bauer says, follow the red pirate parrot. Here it is, right down here. It says techno parrot. You're gonna left click on that and that will open up the user interface. We're gonna do, uh, let's map, only because people talk about it a lot, we're gonna head on down and map Luigi's Mansion. So I've already mapped this, but we're gonna do it again together. Uh, step one, game settings. You need to make sure that this is set to raw input. Repeat, raw input. That's what it needs to be set on. Then head on down here, save settings, and then exit. Uh, and then we're gonna go to control setup. So whatever you set up as your coin button on your control panel, whatever, you wanna set these on your panel because your aim track doesn't have a whole lot of buttons to it. So if you start mapping your coin button to your aim track, you're gonna be in trouble. So set it to whatever you want on your control panel. But the one I wanna start pointing out here is the light gun. So player one light gun, you click on it and it will actually give you a drop down. If you have one, aim track gun, you're going to have just the aim track one. But if you have both aim tracks in, it'll say aim track one and aim track two. Because this is player one, you want to have aim track one selected. Then you're going to go down to the vacuum button. You're going to want to click on that. You're going to want to point at the screen, like no gangster style, no turning it sideways, point at the screen and press one of the side buttons. Mine maps as the right button. Then you're going to want to go down to the next one which is gonna be the vacuum lever. This is actually the suck lever. This is the one that you're gonna be using majority of the time. So you click on that. You wanna, again, make sure it's straight and pull the trigger. As you see on mine, it, it's selected left button. And then that's it for mapping light guns. And you can do the same thing with the um, player two light gun. Just work your way through there. Save your settings when you're done. And that's all she wrote. All right, I hope this uh, video helps you guys, and I look forward to talking to you again sometime soon. Later.